I'm Christine Dunbar from speechmodification.com and this is my smart American accent training. Welcome to our word of the day series where I've been taking your requests for words you'd like help to pronounce in American English. Today's request was for the word twirl and while we're talking about twirl we'll also talk about the words earl, whirl, and swirl because they all have the same pattern with the earl sound. So the combination of the uh, vowel er, that tight American R, and a dark ul, the L sound that we have at the ends of words in American English. So being able to go from my er to my ul sound um, is what I need for all of these words. So starting with the word earl, earl, you can hear when I say it quickly that I just move from the R to the L. But if I go more slowly, Earl, you can hear that there's a little bit of a schwa sound before my dark L. So my tongue is in the tight back R position, er, then it drops into the schwa, uh, while the front of the tongue lifts, ul. Uh. So earl, earl, earl. But it's all one smooth movement between the two. So you don't really want to make a distinct break between your er, uh, and ul. Uh. You just want to make that, um, L, dark L with the tongue in the schwa position and the, the back of the tongue in the schwa position, the front of the tongue lifted. Working on R and L separately is going to really help you when it comes to saying words like Earl and twirl because they're very challenging. I do have videos specifically for words like girl, squirrel, world. Uh, these are similar words and you can get more details in those videos. But building from my earl is going to help me with these words twirl, whirl, and swirl. So if you have trouble with earl, you may find that it's the R or the L that gives you more trouble, or you can do each separately, but putting them together is hard. Maybe building from the back, ul, earl, earl, or visualizing it as those two pieces can help you. It is a one syllable word, but I can think of it almost as being two syllables, er plus ul, earl. Building from earl, let's go next to whirl, um, which has the same exact sounds, just adding a w at the beginning. So again, I can try building from the back, ul, earl, whirl. I can also try just doing the whir part of the word and then moving to my dark L, whirl, whirl. Um, and then eventually I want to be smooth and light across the two, whirl. Once I can say whirl, then I can go to swirl or twirl because they both have that same whirl sound. In swirl, I'm just adding an S sound to my whirl, so trying ul, Earl, whirl, swirl, building it up uh, sound by sound, figuring out where you find those challenges. And lastly, to our requested word twirl, we're going to have the same thing. Building from whirl, twirl, add your T before your W sound, your aspirated T sound. So to say twirl, um, again, build it up from, from the R, from the L, from the W, from the T. Uh, earl, whirl, twirl. Uh, once I can say twirl, whirl, earl, swirl by themselves, I do want to try them in some short phrases. So um, for the person who requested this, um, think about how you would use twirl. She likes to twirl around. There was a special twirl in her step. Whatever it might be that caused you to notice that word is difficult. Do practice in some short phrases so that it comes more smoothly and naturally. You'll find that, for especially for difficult words like these, it, it takes a while to be able to say them smoothly by themselves and then even more time to build them into your speech. But if you persist, you'll build motor habits that will make it come out smoothly and easily the new way. Thank you so much for that request. If you have a request you'd like to see as part of our Word of the Day series, feel free to leave that in the comments for this video or any of my videos. You can get help for the dark L, the er sound, all of these different combinations in our various videos for those sounds, as well as in our Sounds of English course on speechmodification.com. It walks you through every sound of English, talks about accent error patterns you might have, 
and helps you to correct them. That course is under $2 and you can get it on our website, speechmodification.com. Thanks so much to those of you who have joined as channel members and subscribed to the channel. I really appreciate your support. Hope to see you again soon. I'm Christine Dunbar from speechmodification.com. Remember, if you want to sound like a native speaker, you can do it. speechmodification.com. Bye everyone. Hope to see you in class again tomorrow.